Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to today's video guys. And today guys, I'm going to go ahead and be showing you how to blend two images in Pixlr. This is a very simple thing to do guys. So make sure to watch this quick and easy video till the very end, follow my steps correctly so you can make sure that this works the same for you and that you can do this yourself. But yeah guys, let's get straight into it. So the first thing you want to do is go ahead and open up the official Pixlr website right here at pixlr.com if you haven't already. And after opening it up, you'll be greeted by this home page right here here which is the main page where we can get started with logging into your account so here in the upper right corner we have the login option you go ahead and log into your account or if you do not already have one just go and create a new one and after logging in you'll be greeted by this main page right here where we can get started with opening up the photo editor so let's go ahead and open up the photo editor by clicking on it right here and now we can get started with opening up the images that we want to blend so you can open up your images right here directly from your pc i have my images right here and now we can get started with seeing how to blend them basically guys we have all of the options that we need right here at the side screen as you can see in this toolbar are all the effects that we can use such as a range cropping cutout and so on and we can get started with combining these effects to get our desired blend effect so some of the effects that you can get started with using is the adjust option so here you can adjust the colors so that the colors of your two images blend together and work together so that you can get that blend effect after you are satisfied with your colors you can use the color option if you want to cut out one part of the picture so that you can blend it better with the other one you can remove the background or your objects from the image and so on so those are the facts that you can try we have the filter effects that you can also try but our ai tools are what's going to help us the most because with the ai tools we can get started with as you can see we can automatically remove our background objects and so on and get started with making the pictures blend in the best they can after that we can just retouch with something that we need to get our desired effect but basically you can go ahead and get started around with playing around with effects so that you can get your desired effect with blending so that's how to do it guys i hope this video was helpful if it was make sure to leave a like subscribe to the channel see you guys thank you for watching take care and bye